Many libraries today are using instant messaging or chat tools to provide virtual reference services. Benefits to using instant messaging tools for reference services include opening up service to patrons who cannot or prefer not to visit the library, providing instant service to patrons via a method they are familiar with, and reaching out with another way of offering reference in addition to in-person phone and email service. In this video, we will look at how Mebo, a free web-based instant messaging system, can be used as a virtual reference tool. To add Mebo to your library website, you will first need to register for a Mebo account. You will need an email address and a name for your library. You will then be prompted to create a Mebo ID, add in other information about your account, and to agree to Mebo's terms and privacy policy. At this point, you can now add other IM services that you use, such as Google Talk or Facebook Chat, to your Mebo. Messages that are sent to these services will now show up on your Mebo account, saving you from having to log into multiple IM services at once. You can always go back and add more accounts to your Mebo by clicking on Sign On to More Accounts at a later time. To create a Mebo Me widget to add to your library website, select the Preferences drop-down menu and click on Mebo Me Widgets. Next, give a name to your widget and then select the size that you'd like it to be. You can now choose to either select the code for your widget and embed it in your website's HTML or modify the code to customize the style of your widget. By customizing your widget, you can choose the color, size, and style that will best complement the design of your library's website. Be sure to save your changes once you have customized your widget to suit your website. Copy the code and then paste it into your text editor. Check that your code has rendered properly and then upload the files to your server. Now patrons can type their questions into the Mebo question box. Patrons do not need to set up an account or install any software on their computer. If you are logged into your Mebo account, you will hear the Mebo alert sound, notifying you that someone has sent a question. If you are not logged in, the question will be available next time you log into your account. Send your response back to the patron. They will see your answer appear on the library website on their own computer.